Hello, welcome to the Windows 2007 calendar tutorial. Using a calendar is one of the most age-old tools of time management. A computer calendar takes this tool a leap forward by allowing you to set reminders for appointments, assign priority to events, and view your calendar in monthly, weekly, and daily formats. Windows 2000 Calendar is available to every employee of B&B Enterprises as it is a program installed on every company computer. Windows 2007 Calendar is found by clicking the Start button on your computer, clicking All Programs, and then locating Windows Calendar within the program list. Once you have the calendar program open, you can create a new calendar by clicking on File and clicking New Calendar. As you can see, I already have a personal calendar, and you can create as many calendars as you wish. For the purposes of this training, though, I will name this calendar B&B Enterprises. Once you have your calendar created, you can change the view of the calendar by clicking on View and then selecting one of the shown options, Day, Work Week, Week, or Month. I will keep the calendar on the monthly view for purposes of this demonstration. To schedule an appointment, simply click on the day that your appointment is scheduled for, let's say the 20th, and click New Appointment. This will pull up a sidebar that will allow you to format the details of the appointment. Here you can name your appointment, name the location, Choose which calendar you want this appointment to show up on. And finally, do extra appointment information. Here, you can schedule the times that the appointment will last. If you have an all-day appointment, simply click the all-day appointment bar. Otherwise, you can check from one day to another and signify which time your appointment will last. If the appointment you are scheduling is a common appointment, you can make it show up on multiple dates by clicking on the Recurrence button. Here you can make it show up every day, weekly, monthly, yearly, or click the Advanced button to look at several different options. Furthermore, you can also set a reminder at different intervals of time so that your computer will remind you of your appointment and when it is. I have it set to two hours, therefore two hours before my appointment my computer will notify me of the upcoming appointment. Finally, you can also type in the attendees of the event and write yourself a note about the appointment so that you can remember this when you are looking at the appointment. This process is exactly the same when scheduling a new task for which you would simply click New Task and go through the same process. This concludes the training on Windows 2007 Calendar. I encourage you to utilize this invaluable tool to help better manage your time. Thank you.